Hi, I'm Steve Kaufman, and this is week three of The Sober Year. To address a couple comments, and thank you all so much for liking, subscribing, commenting, I just have a few things I, I will address. No, I'm not being held captive by the North Koreans. This is just a nice big blank wall. Also, I am trying to limit my sugar intake, and that includes fizzy drinks. However, things like ginger beer or punch are a once-in-a-while thing for me, and I will have no problem partaking on occasion. So last Wednesday, I got access to the red carpet for the GLOW premiere on Sunset Boulevard. GLOW, which is on Netflix. It's women, it's wrestling, it's on Netflix. It's a trifecta of things I'm into. What's normally the case for me would be I'd find out where the after party is because the after party would have an open bar. And instead of instinctually doing that, this time I just didn't ask anybody where the after party was. So I just, I just, like, stole some popcorn and went home. Thursday, I was at both a friend's birthday party and working a different party at Universal Studios. The friend's birthday party was at a tiki bar, and I spent $5 on ginger beer. Like I said up top, love me some ginger beer, love me some punch, love me some sugary drinks, but I try my best to keep them on the DL. Friday was very interesting because I wound up running a live stream of a fashion show at a club and the people who I was running the stream for were also sponsors so literally they were walking around with Ciroc and Hennessy and uh, really really wanted me to have some and I did not. Partially because I do not like Hennessy at all and partially because I'm obviously not drinking. Saturday night I was both dealing poker in Irvine but also um, talking to a lot of event planners, both Saturday and Sunday, actually. And a trick I learned there, when everyone was drinking, was that I didn't feel like having to explain it to, like, this whole year off thing I'm doing. I didn't feel like having to explain to everyone I met. So what I did was ask the bartender for soda water, but please give it to me in the same glass you would give someone a vodka soda. It's an optics thing. Optically, it makes way more sense to see me holding what you would assume is a vodka soda instead of the big plastic cup of water or the big plastic cup with the straw of like regular soda or anything like that that I think that's my new trick. So if anyone sees me out in the wild and I'm holding what appears to be a vodka soda, it's actually just soda water. You can smell it if you want. Sunday night was the first night I've gambled since I've made this vow to not drink. And it was really interesting because... I was playing poker, and I was playing way better poker than I'd ever played before because I wasn't drinking. And I think that's actually a huge benefit that I should have been doing this whole time when, like, if I'm at a poker table, I'm not necessarily at a poker table to have a good time. I'm at a poker table to win. Monday, I was fortunate enough to be second row at a wrestling show in my neighborhood. No, no, not Raw at the Staples Center. There was a SmackDown house show in Bakersfield. WWE was good enough to give AfterBuzz TV three tickets. I was one of the three people who got to go to Bakersfield. Had a great time. And I think I've mentioned on this show before that there's something about pro wrestling and a big cold beer. So it was a bit of a trigger for me, especially second row, top of the world kind of feeling, to just not drink. But then the actual matches started, and I didn't care. Well, yeah, that was my week. This is day 27. I'm going strong. I think on a check-in, I'm absolutely going to make it. If these 27 days are any indicator, I'm absolutely going to make it the other 340... Oh, God. Oh, God, that's such a long time. No, I'm, I'm actually going to make it. I'm actually going to do it. Hey, thanks for watching the video. Please, right down here, click like and subscribe, unless it's up here here because or it's over here things are weird but click it wherever it is also leave me a comment below